Hey there YouTube, it's Brad with another knife review. Today I'm reviewing the Zero Tolerance Hinderer 0566 BW Assisted Opening Knife. The 0566 is the kind of smaller brother to the 560 slash 561 model. Um, beautiful size. The 560 is a big knife. This is a little bit more suitable for EDC. Alright, let's quickly talk about the specifications on this knife. It has an overall length of 7.7 .7 inches. We have a blade length of 3.25 inches with a thickness of 0.12. The blade's made out of the beautiful LMAX steel. Super hard, super sharp, holds an edge, good corrosion resistance, it's a great steel. The blade itself has a drop point with a flat grind, acid wash, and a plain edge. The scales on this knife are a really nice textured G10 on the one side, while on the back side, the black wash stainless steel is the other handle. Here we have the standard ZT pocket clip, which has got a nice retention. It's not too tight, but it's not loose that it's going to be falling out of your pocket. We have a large lanyard hole, suitable for paracord. We have, on the middle of the handle, we have a frame lock with a lock stop to keep it from over-traveling. It uses Torx hardware on both sides. The knife has amazing jimping at the base of the knife as well in the thumb area as well as the back of the blade. Uh, the jimping is fantastic. It's very grippy without chewing your finger up. The lock up on this knife is perfect. There's no play in the blade at all. Left to right, up and down, is probably the most solid knife I've ever owned. The deployment on this knife is flipper style. Although it shows a thumb stud, it's not designed for using. It's meant to be there as a blade lock, and it works very well. Deployment on this knife is exceptionally fast, exceptionally strong. It has the flipper on the back here. And with a simple flick, the knife jumps out with lightning speed. And again, no play in the blade at all. The assisted spring is very easily removed by removing the scales and removing the torsion bar, which I've done and then put back in, depending on what you like. I, I bought this knife for the assist, but some people don't like it. I do. The knife has a three pillar stainless steel spacers in the back, keeping it light. And as you can see, let's see if I can line it up. The blade centering is perfect. The fit and finish on this knife is exceptional. I haven't found one flaw in the design. It is super, super clean, super sharp easy to hold. It's got a good weight. I think it weighs in around 5.3 ounces, which I like. I like a heavy knife. Some might find that a bit heavy, but I like the feel of something in my hand that has some weight. If anybody out there is contemplating purchasing the Zero Tolerance 0566, either in the black wash or the satin wash, I highly recommend it. It is by far one of the very best knives I've ever owned, and I look forward to uh, putting it to some good hard use over the next few years. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for my next review. Take care, YouTube.